industrial revolution origin inventions and spread is one of the major topic in the syllabus of punjab university ba final history course in this presentation a sample answer is provided welcome to quick brief presentation i am your host sumir sharma the topic for the presentation is industrial era industrial revolution its origin inventions and spread now let us see how we can cover up the industrial revolution in question and answer form the suggestive questions that has been asked in university question paper of punjab university can be suggested as follows the question which has appeared in the university examination are framed somewhat like this the study study the progress of the industrial revolution in europe second question is study the causes of rise and spread of industrial revolution in europe there are other formats of questions also but we are going to confine ourselves to a single answer which justify the requirement of the question let us begin with the question i have called it industrial era industrial revolution origin inventions and spread i have tried to explain this topic in following five headings they are the industrial era causes of origin new inventions impact on society debate on the terms of industrial revolution and industrial era origin and new inventions the cause of industrial revolution the new inventions and finally the spread of the industrial revolution it will give you an mental image of the overall content of this answer i will strongly recommend you that you must make use of a page and pen to write down the core structure of the answer it will help you to develop a grip over the whole content now first of all i will like to take up the topic the industrial era the industrial era does not appear in the syllabus in the syllabus it is called the industrial revolution however i have tried to give an ex explanation which just uh, qualify the term the industrial era it includes lot of discussion and reading to understand how this term is used along with the term industrial revolution the second topic which i have taken up is the debate on the term industrial revolution and industrial era in which i have tried to explain why i have presented this topic in the following manner now after the debate i begin with the actual text of the question answer and it begins with origin and new invention the cause of industrial revolution no doubt it is accepted by the academicians as well as the established scholars that the industrial revolution as a historic development had taken place in britain and no doubt you may get a question in the university asking you to emphasize this point we will develop our answer in the manner wherein this aspect is explained without asking for this particular aspect of historic development in order to explain this change in the development of world history i have given 
these following 14 points. So I just read out the major points. These points are the peace established by parliament form of government in Britain, political freedom to the people in Britain. Britain became the earlier colonial power, flexible guild system of England, supremacy of British Navy, blessing of nature, natural resources in complementary arrangement, growing of scientific temperament, vigorous health system, mature trade, colony of India, or uh, then a dwelt banking system, asylum to skilled immigrants, agrarian revolution. These are very vast topics. You cannot explain all the aspects of this historic development within 40 minutes. I emphasize that you must develop an answer which, which you can write within 40 minutes. Most of the question and especially of world history are such that it requires lot of reading and understanding. But if you are developing an answer, you should be very specific and the way out is to develop a point oriented structure of your answer in order to convince the paper checker that you understand the different dimensions of the development of this historic idea which had influenced the world history. After that, I had taken the new inventions, which were, is a very important aspect of the development of industrial revolution. And the first topic which I had taken is the invention in textile industry. Similarly, the, in case of new invention, I have taken up the invention of steam power, then invention in coal and iron industry. The, after that, I have covered the invention in the means of transport and communication. Then finally, the spread of the industrial revolution. I have especially develop all these points with an idea of developing short answer. I have highlighted or rather made the name of the inventors and the invention in bold words so that you can identify the short answers. These are the short answers which have already been asked in the university question paper. They have been, they, I have in, intendedly developed this uh, text so that you can easily identify all the short answers which are related to, to this particular question. No doubt you have to spend some time in order to remember all these inventions. After that, you have to write an elaboration on the, of the spread of industrial revolution from Britain to other European countries. This is the topic which is being asked again and again in the question paper. I have given a very brief uh, uh, write-up on this topic. I have covered Belgium, France, Germany and Russia. As this question is very vast, you can just see if you, you can not write a answer within 40 minutes if you try to explain whatsoever the question the university paper setter generally asks. You can just give a near about picture of the overall developments which are being asked in the question. The text of this question answer is also available in the published book. The book is written by me and it is readily available on Google ePlaybooks and it is free of cost. You can download it from the Google ebooks site and the detail is already provided in the description. The Kindle format book is also available on Amazon. It includes the answer 
which is shown to you here and the details are given in the description you can assess it from the Amazon author page description provided given in the description the ACN number of this book is highlighted on your left hand side apart from that you can use Google form link provided in the description in order to get a PDF format of this single question. I really thank you for watching. I heartily thank you for watching. Oblige me by subscribing and commenting. Thanks for watching.